Welcome back to American Latino TV. Up next is the amazing story of Monica Gonzalez, a native of Texas who played soccer for the University of Notre Dame, then gave up a chance to ever play on the U.S. national team to become a founding member and captain of the first women's national Mexican team. She led the team to the 1999 FIFA Women's World Cup and the 2004 Olympics and now is using her legacy for her own foundation aimed at helping young girls learn and play soccer both in Mexico and the USA. Check her out. American Latino Athletes, presented by McDonald's. My name is Monica Gonzalez. I'm the former captain of the Mexican women's national team and current ESPN sideline reporter for the MLS, U.S. men's national team, and color commentator. I grew up in Corpus Christi, Texas. I played soccer because I had brothers and because my dad played, but there weren't leagues for girls. So my dad uh, had me join a boys team, and I played with boys till I was 10. Never knew the difference, never realized. You know, obviously I know I was the only girl, but I just figured I was the only girl that played soccer. I played soccer at Notre Dame, and while I was at Notre Dame, I got a call and an invitation to join the Mexican national team. Uh, but I realized that because of my grandfather, I could get citizenship, so I went to a camp to see what, you know, what it was all about. Once you decide to play for a country in a qualifier for an Olympics or a World Cup, you're stuck with that team. And I knew there was a risk that maybe we would qualify or I would play three qualifier games for Mexico, we would lose, and then the Mexican Federation would say, no way, we don't want a Mexican national team. It's not worth it. And I would get stuck not being able to play ever in a World Cup or an Olympics. Now, 20 years later, it was the best thing that I ever did. It was the best decision I ever made because it completely changed, changed my life. I now live in Mexico City. I have a nonprofit soccer academy in the Latino communities here in the United States, in Mexico, and in Colombia. Así me da la opción de ir fácilmente con parte externa y ir para allá, o parte interna y ir para allá. My foundation, Gonzo Soccer, is a soccer leadership academy for girls. It's a nonprofit. Uh, we have three pillars we focus on, on giving the girls elite soccer training, giving them academic assistance, and guiding them so that every girl has the opportunity to go to college and life skills lessons or leadership training. <laughs> have the opportunity for these girls to play and be trained by women who played at the highest level. So they're trained by the best coaches I can find in the community. They get life skills lessons, they get academic assistance, uh, really lessons that anybody could utilize at any level, no matter where you're coming from. Sports psychology, setting goals, nutrition, um, but also the opportunity to play and compete and, and learn and grow from the game of soccer. The big lesson for me over time is that I don't have to be either Mer American or Mexican, I can be both. Still have a little bit of an accent, um, but, but it's sort of become my, my life mission and I, I did never get that gold medal or, or win, win a World Cup like I had always wanted, but I think that I've been able to, to help grow the game of soccer in a way that I never would have been able to had I not decided to play for the Mexican national team.